Hi, I'm Noam Levy, a senior correspondent at Kaiser Health News. I've been writing about healthcare in America for almost 15 years. And in that time, I've talked to a lot of people who've had trouble paying their medical bills. That's why KHN and NPR are taking a deeper look at just how many people are in debt because of healthcare. What we've found is troubling. Four in 10 adults today are in debt because of a medical or dental bill, according to a poll by KFF conducted for this project. That's about 100 million people. People like Allison Ward. Allie is a nurse in Chicago. She and her husband ended up with $80,000 in medical debt after their twin boys were born prematurely and ended up in the NICU. They ended up having to load up credit cards, borrow from relatives, and move cross country to be closer to family. Allie took on extra nursing shifts, working days and nights. Over the next year, we'll visit with people who've been driven from their homes, who've had to cut back on groceries, and who've been denied care at the doctor's office because of money they owe. We'll look at how hospitals are feeding this crisis. And we'll explore the debt industry that's become a fixture of American healthcare. I hope you'll join us for this series we're calling Diagnosis 